All these other sweaters are just gonna magically get up and fold themselves? No, Glenn, because magic doesn't exist. What is her customer? Oh. The sign says, do not sit. I'm, I'm feeding my child. So. I'm feeding my child. So. No one cares, you're not special. Yeah, so could you scram? I'm trying. I'm you oh, you're trying your bag and vertical. the baby and your boobs okay, need to go. Hey, keep your saggy boobs to yourself. Oops, did Jerry say something? I didn't hear him complain at the time. That's because he's very soft-spoken. Ow, stop. You stop. Whoa. Right? Whoa? Bet your ass, whoa. These are the mind control machines. Are you sure? Totally. Close your eyes and picture a room full of mind control machines. What do they look like? They look like this. Jesus, people, this is just tech stuff. You know, you've got your basic blinking lights, the blues, the greens, the yellow. I mean, that's not common, but it's still in the bounds. Yeah, I'm sorry. You're right. This is all completely normal. I... Freedom! What? <gasps> okay, no, stop. Let him work, Tina. I don't want to hurt you. No, Tina. Red pill. Keanu. Marcus, enough. I'll bring the I think we did it. Hey, man. The Wow, wound a little tightly there, buddy. Everything all right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, no, you know what? Uh, everything's not all right. I think they're spying on our phones. What? I thought you said I was the paranoid one. I thought you were, but then they started following me around. They started searching my stuff. That woman in the cafe who's pretending to read the newspaper. Nobody reads newspapers anymore. I do. No, you don't. You say you do, but you don't. Guys, something crazy is happening. There are men in black suits swarming the parking lot saying things like, Quantico, this is Daniels, and Uncle Phil is on the move. I repeat, Uncle Phil is on the move. Wow, that is too crazy. The only question is, who is Uncle Phil? Probably someone that looks like Uncle Phil. It's me! I look like Uncle Phil! Man, why'd you do that stupid Google search? Whoa, calm down. No, I'm not gonna calm down. You calm down. You're always starting stuff. Hey, Garrett, let's Google how to murder somebody. Will you happy now? What's next? Hey, Garrett, let's tell Zephra to email the police and tell him I just planted a bomb in the store. Emailing local police. I just planted a bomb in the store. Oh. Would you like to send? N n yes. <gasps> what? No! Okay, I've sent your email. Why? Amy, could I say a few words? Um, okay. Screw management! Okay. Once we clock out, Amy can't make us do a damn thing. If you see a loose car in the parking lot, you can kick it over or shove it in the traffic. Seems like just as much work. Also, managers can't give us polygraph tests. I wasn't planning on giving anyone a polygraph test. Well, good, because we ain't taking one, Amy. Mm -hmm. Stay strong, people. Woo! Rise up. Set up for your rights. Power to the people. Keep top. Hey, Sandra. Um, handing out some flyers? Yeah. You want one? Sandra says no to hate and yes to freedom. Oh. Seems uncontroversial. Mm. I'm not a hero. So, um, Sandra, I I need you to, to stop talking about all this union stuff. You're not allowed to restrict my speech. It's it's for your own good. Wow, so now you got your muscle trying to threaten me? Jonah, the muscle? I mean, okay. Seems like a weird thread to pull. Did everyone hear that? Amy is now telling me that I can't even talk about unions. No. Amy, is that true? I don't think you're allowed to do that. I was just saying that while she's at work. This is my work now. The work of justice. The only work that matters. Where are you getting, is this from a play? No. Sandra, look, I get that this is fun. 
but corporate is taking this seriously. You hear that, everyone? Corporate is taking us seriously. No, what I mean is that corporate is viewing this as a threat. And they view us as a threat. You maybe want to think of your phrasing before so that you don't twist your yeah, word. No, I'm, I'm, I'm getting oh, that. No, Wait, what Sandra, are you doing? Can you, can you please uh, not get up on the... Okay. No, if you could oh, just... just stand up. Management is trying to silence us. Oh, my God. But our voices will be heard. No, nobody was trying to silence anybody. She was somewhat. Glenn. Well, you were. Well, if we can't talk here, then we will talk elsewhere. Union meeting tonight. Location, TBD. Time, TBD. Refreshments, TBD. So you're canceling the health fund. Um, no. Uh, the fund will continue. It will just be more of a selective, sort of case-by-case case situation. You're kicking us out. No. No. No, no. It's just, you know, our vision uh, was a lot more idealistic than the realities of the world. Guys, we are we're really sorry, um, but we are giving you back your premiums, Isaac. How about that? There you go. Sandra? Mm -hmm. No. You're trying to f us. Whoa. You're trying to f us. Well, you picked the wrong day to f with Sandra Kaluuya Kalani. Oh, okay, S Sandra, just calm down. No! I won't calm down. We have a contract and I can sue. So figure it out! Can I help you do your car now? Don't leave us. I mean, I know it's not a perfect workplace, but we love each other here. Can you head off of my Excuse me, I have got to go stop the love. Sandra. Who is Sandra? Where is that? All right. Now, Sandra, it, it says here that you want to kill a co-worker named Carol. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Sandra, I understand. When I'm frustrated, I want to wring someone's neck. Exactly. Ring it hard. So what do you do? What do you do when that feeling comes over you? Well, I put on a hoodie that covers my face, and I take the 47 bus line to a library in a faraway town. Then I open a private browser on one of their computers and Google how I'm thinking of killing her to see what mistakes people usually make. Jesus. We should step it up in this challenge and beat them. Yeah, enough is enough. This just got very personal. Mm. Let's end those sons of bitches. Let's destroy Bell Ridge. I'm so sick of this Sandra? No. Why don't you take your 10 now? So you know how me and Carol hate each other. Well, I hate her, actually. She looks up to me. Anyway, I paid four different guys to come into the store and ask her out and then never show up. Nice. Carol, honey, I found a clump of your hair. I'm going to put it in your pocket. And again, Carol, I am so sorry, but you are going to be fine. People get electrocuted all the time. It's like good for you. It's a cleanse. You're going to feel great. What happened? Amy electrocuted her. Not on purpose. I mean, she's going to be fine. Oh, no. What if she's not, though? Dina doesn't want me putting items on the floor. Well, I am going to show her just how many items I can put on the floor. I'm going to put out thousands. There's only 78 tablets. Well, well, then we'll put out 78, but it'll be the most 78 you've ever seen. Oh, absolutely not. Get out of my way. Come on. Sandra, Sandra. walk her with your body. Sandra, subdue him. No. Uh, uh. Sandra, what are you doing? I'm sick of you two. Figure it out. I don't need the stress. A chunk of my hair fell out, and I will not be bald for my wedding! Sandra! Sandra, oh, finally! Come get me down! Oh, thank God. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, no. Are you serious? Oh, I respect you as much as I hate you right now. Oh, Sandra!